Digo is a powerful tool for keeping track of bookmarks online and sharing them with others. But how do you add bookmarks? Let's start by heading to digo.com. Once you're at the Digo website, look for the Tools page. The link is located in the navigation bar on the upper right hand side. This will take you to a page with all sorts of additional tools available from Digo. In our case, we want to click on the link for the Digolet button. When you click on Digolet, it will take you to a page with directions specific to the browser that you're currently using. Digo can see that I'm using Firefox, so it's taken me to the page with directions for installing the Digolet button in Firefox. To install the Digolet button, just grab it from the web page and pull it into your bookmarks bar. Once the Digolet button is added to your bookmarks bar, you can begin bookmarking web pages anywhere on the internet. When you find a page you want to bookmark, click on the Digolet button. This will launch a small bookmark bar on the upper right hand side of the web page that you're viewing. You'll see a button to highlight text on the page, bookmark the page to come back to later, add a sticky note, share with Facebook, Twitter or email, and a link back to your Digo library. When you click on the bookmark button, a small window pops up. The information you add in this window will help you search for this web page later. Digo fills in the address for the page and the title. There's also a place for you to add a description and add search terms, these are called tags, to your entry. There's also a button to share this page with a group. If you've joined the group for professional leadership, you should see it show up when you click on the drop down menu to share to a group. Once you're done, just click Save Bookmark. You'll notice that the bookmark icon in the Digo toolbar has changed colors. This handy visual reminder lets you know that you've bookmarked the page. When you head back to your Digo library, you'll see your latest bookmarks at the top of your list. If you want to change any of the information associated with any of your bookmarks in your Digo library, you can do that by clicking on the Edit Link button underneath the bookmark for a specific page. You can change the description, add more search terms, or share to a group from this window. When you're done, just click Save. To get to your groups, click on the My Groups link in your Digo library. Here you'll see a list of all of the groups that you're a member of. When you click on the link to a specific group, you'll be taken to the Share Digo list for that group. Good luck everyone, and happy bookmarking!